Good morning. How are you guys? I hope everybody's doing well. Everybody's chasing goals and we are focused. Okay, today is a beautiful Tuesday. The time now is five minutes past eight. I am preparing to go get my hair done. I know that's right. So um, I'm going to do braids. You guys are going to see. I'm going to do braids. And this time around, I'm not doing black. I'm going to do like this goldish colorful. I mean, like this goldish beautiful color. So come with me to do my hair. But first I want to make breakfast because I'm going to spend the whole day there. I would ideally like to take something to grab while I'm there. But um, I will see when I get there. I can get So... I made myself this drink. I'm not consistent with drinking this, mainly because I don't have any ulcers. Um, I don't get heartburns like that. But this, if you suffer from heartburn, this is your go-to. You can get this at pharmacies like Discam and Clicks. This is the product, Avogel Multiforce Alkaline Powder. It assists in the maintenance of acid and alkaline balance. It has got really good properties. You just take one heaped teaspoon with a glass full of water, mix it up, and you drink. You take this 30 minutes before you eat. So yeah, um, this has got like a lot of health benefits. They say it supports bone health. It also alleviates heartburn, as I said, and digestive tract discomfort due to excess acid. It supports health uric acid levels. It maintains and supports urinary tract function so this is a really good um a product to invest in i worked with them last year and i've been taking it on days where i feel like i want my morning routine to bang but i don't want to come here and lie i'm not taking this thing consistently because it, it doesn't have taste but also it's not nice so let's down it <laughs> so what I do is once I start drinking I don't stop because if I were to take sips and stop sip and stop I wouldn't finish it I like the fact that at least it comes in different flavors when you drink it this one is mango you smell the mango even though it doesn't have taste no sugar nothing but you do smell the mango and then there's such it as well this is the original flavor no taste none whatsoever the original flavor it doesn't even have any fruity smell or anything like that the the package came in this box they were so considerate they sent me a whole lot of things guys see we have natural lemon i hope you guys can see the original one natural lemon flavor and mango and then it also comes with tablets as well the tablet helps with flu and colds god blessed me with good health i hardly catch flu guys i hardly feel sick but that doesn't stop me from taking supplements this one you can also get at clicks and discount like pharmacies that's all that i wanted to say i hardly get sick i hardly go to the hospital i hardly go to the doctor but i do take supplements i have these ones 
and I also take supplements that helps with appetite because I've struggled with appetite for the longest time but I don't take them every day because now I think my appetite levels are in a good position and I also take probiotics that helps with maintaining good bacteria for my little girl down there so that's what i do if you would like to see a video where i show you the supplements and the probiotics that i take then i can film a video specifically for that otherwise i'm gonna make breakfast now and then i'm gonna get ready because i want to be at the salon at least by half past nine I love this blueberry sauce. I bought it at Checkers. Um, I normally have my muesli with plain yogurt, so this is just to add the sweetness. But now it's finished. Oh, guys, I forgot to show you. I did my nails. Hmm. I got my nails done yesterday. If you are in Pretoria Central, then I'm gonna leave the details. I really, really love them. And I've been doing my nails with her. I think this was my second time. So yeah. A spoonful of happiness. <laughs> nice okay i haven't done braids in a minute and if you're an og let me take this off then you know i love braids i just love myself a good clean hairdo and today i wanted to try color my goal this year my goal for the longest time has been trying color because i always do color one i mean yeah i always do color one which is black or color two which is closer to black other than that i'm not that colorful okay but i was like there's a first time for everything so i saw an inspiration on instagram i saw this color and i showed the lady she was like girl i got you okay so yeah this is my hair i got this braids in pretoria central i do everything in pretoria central now i got the braids for 850 at this salon called Meloni Hair Studio. It's in Pretoria Central on Nanasita Street and Sisulu. So if you know Pretoria, then you know. So yeah, this is where I got them. I love them so much. Khabare mood booster. Probably like I when your hair is done and your nails done. Then you know that you know what? Nobody, nothing's gonna take you down because you just feel like you're on top of the world. <laughs> So yeah, um, I think I mentioned in my previous vlog that I am going to an event this uh, Thursday on the 22nd. So me doing all this makeover, it is actually motivated by the event that I'm going to. But anyway, I wanted to do my hair and my nails. But because now I have 
one more reason why I should do my hair and nails so I decided to do them today I mean to do them now so yeah this is me um, I'm so excited and nervous at the same time tomorrow it's a Wednesday I'll probably go to pick and pay this this other top that I want to conclude my outfit also you will see my outfit when I get that top so that you get the idea the code the dress code for the event is business they said business dress code right so it's like corporate dress it's like formal so i'm not really somebody who wears formal stuff that much but i do have two or three things that i can put together so i just want to get that little thing i just want to get that top that i saw at pick and pay and complete the look otherwise i don't want to rumble or talk too much i'm going to film another video for youtube which is going to go live tonight before i go to bed so that's my skincare evening skincare routine i'm going to film that because you know when you do your hair and you just instantly get that glow so i think this is a perfect time for me to do like a cute aesthetically pleasing kind of um evening skincare routine so yeah do stay tuned by the time you see this vlog that video is already up so i assume you've seen the video <laughs> bye good night Good morning! Today is finally the day of the event. Yesterday was Wednesday. I wanted to vlog but I was tired. And also there was nothing much happening in my life yesterday. It was just work and then I got back and made some dinner. I made mac and cheese with some beef patties. So yeah, that's what I had for dinner last night. And we also had low shading, so I was like, right, let me just use the time to rest. I didn't upload on, on TikTok or Instagram. I did not edit. I just watched vlogs. I had my journaling session, read the word of God and prayed and then went straight to bed. So, yeah. I just got ready. I'm wearing this top that I got from H&M. And then these jeans are from Zara. And then the slides, I don't know if you guys can see the slides are from mr price so i want to go out i have an outfit planned in mind i hope that it comes together so i want to go get the pants if i don't get the pants i have other pants that i think i can use but if i get the pants that i have in mind then i think it's going to blend perfectly with what i have already and i also want um you see this throw on jerseys that they put you, you'll get the vibes you'll see you'll see so yeah that's what i want to do and then come back there'll be load shedding from 12 till 2 then from half past 2 i want to start getting ready so that i can leave the house at 5 the event starts at 6 at least an hour for me to get there and get like parking space and stuff like that so yeah that's the agenda of the day you guys are gonna get ready with me you guys are gonna see everything i'm taking you along to the event because this is my first time ever and on this channel if you know we are celebrating big wins small wins and everything in between so that's what i'm going to do i'm taking you guys along with me let's go to the mall <laughs> exactly what i had in mind so i'm definitely gonna take this but they are two million basic white t-shirt like this one this retails for 100 grand the price is expensive hey i think i like these shoes 
I think I like these shoes. If they were only in size 4, because now they fit too tight. And if I get them, I will have to... What's this? Get brown pants instead of the black ones. Check the price. 80 bucks, you guys. 80 rents. Oh, my... Not again, really. Eh? But yeah, this would... It's a cute kitten block heel. I think I'm transitioning. 30 is knocking, guys, so it's time. It's time. Back from the mall, and this is all that we got. I found these pretty shoes that made me want to change my outfit, but it ended up not working because the pants were just not going. I mean, we're just not fitting properly. So I ended up just buying the black ones. So these are the pants that I'm going to wear. So what confuses me is the dress code is business, but the event, it's a, what's it called? It's a, what's this thing? Cocktail reception. So I don't know, guys. I don't know if I'm going to be out of theme. The, okay, cocktail reception. But the dress, I mean, the dress code is business. I don't know if it makes sense. Or it's me that just doesn't get it. Because normally, cocktail events, you find that they wear those, especially evening events, they wear those glitter dresses, you know, those sleeve dresses and stuff. But now, this one is different. The dress code is business. Anyway, if I don't feel comfortable when I get there, I'll see what I, what I do when I'm there. But yeah, I got them for 250 They fit so perfect. And then I went to pick and pay clothing. I've been wanting these jerseys for winter. So I got motivated to buy them today. They have a special of two for $3.30. One is like $189.99, $190. So I got these two. So I'm going to use this one since well. I'm going with the black and white um, outfit. And then I got this shirt it's just a normal round neck so i'm going to wear this and tuck it in a little bit with the pants the black pants and then the jersey on top i don't know if you guys get the vibes so these are the shoes that actually confused me because i like after i saw these shoes i wanted to opt for a nude um nude pants i wanted to opt for nude pants to pair them with a white shirt this jersey and these shoes so the nude pants were just not coming to the party they did not fit well and these were like on special i've got them for 80 rands so i'll just keep them because they are pretty good shoes but yeah that's the outfit the time now it's two o'clock i want to make something to eat actually i'll warm up yesterday's food have something to eat and start prepping myself i feel so nervous because i'm not confident in my outfit i'm really not confident i don't want to get there and then the next thing people are wearing you know dresses with sleeves and heels Woo, sana i really don't know but we'll see we'll see I'm almost done with my makeup. I wanted to do it off camera because if I did it with you guys, I was going to take long. So now I'm just going to go in with this um, pressed powder in the shade 360 Mocha and just contour. Just contour quickly. Um, I'm so happy that my eyebrows came out pretty good. You know when you do your makeup, I start with my eyebrows. So once my eyebrows comes out good, then I know it's a green light. So yeah, that's where we are. Don't wanna put a lot also. Forehead. Double chin where? What are you talking about? <laughs> Okay, and blush. I'm gonna go in with this blush palette from Mr. Price. This two, oops, 
these two shades over here. The time now is 20 minutes to 5. And I want to leave the house 10 past 5. So, hopefully. Oh, I forgot to control the nose. I forgot to control the nose. Okay, we're going to lead the nerves, guys. I am so nervous. We got to get an interview. Okay. Then I'm gonna go in with this um, highlighter palette also from Mr. Price. We just add a bit of highlight. Now I'm just going to do my lips. I'm going to go in with this um, brown lipstick from Mr. Price as well. Then just outline my lips. Oh, I forgot setting spray. Maybelline setting spray. I forgot setting spray. And I like to set before I do my lips. I've got an electric fan now. I'm gonna lock up everything. Then back to the lips. I'm gonna go in with this lipstick from Clicks by Essence Cosmetics. I want a nude lip. I don't want um, colorful makeup tonight. I just wanna keep it simple. This is such a perfect nude. I forgot I actually have this lipstick. I love to keep my lips matte. Do you see what I'm talking about? Perfect nude lipstick. All the way from Clicks by Essence Cosmetics. So yeah, this is the final look. This is the final look. Let me try to pack up and then we can dress up. This is how I look. Let me look myself in the mirror properly. Yo, Sana, I nailed this look, okay? I nailed it. This this is soft. Ooh, Sana. What's happening here? Okay. Okay. This is outfit of the day, finally. This is how I am looking. Pick and pay, pick and pay, Mr. Price. The vibes and the shoes are super list. Earrings are the fix. Watch, legit, ring, Mr. Price. So this is where it's at. 
I feel so hot. And for perfume, I'm wearing my favorite Elisab in white. It smells so good. I also have it in my bag, in my atomizer. So yeah. Let's get going. The time now, it's 10 minutes past five. I know that's right. Per. <laughs> I love my makeup, guys. The plan was to get there at least half past five or twenty to five, and there's traffic. I just left the house like a minute ago, and there's already traffic. So, ooh, child. I hope I get parking space because that's what they said. First come, first serve. Let's go. Quick update. I've made it in time. I got here and I got parking. The time now is five minutes to six. Just the event is just about to start, so I just changed my shoes. I'm gonna go in now and mingle, mingle. I'm a little bit nervous. I see people are going in on the Let's go. I'm in waterproof, guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> So if you follow me on my Instagram and TikTok, then you are familiar with this. This is like a little setup of the products that they have. So cute, isn't it? So the event is about a Vogel celebrating 100 years passion for plants. So that is what we are here for. This is actually my favorite soap. What's this now? Oh, this is the menu. Okay. I'm actually now just waiting for my drink because I don't drink alcohol anymore. So, yeah. that everybody seems to be knowing each uh, knowing each other look at my background just look at my background and i don't have a friend Ooh, Simon. our event runs smoothly kindly note that we will be taking photos uh, linda is here as you can see throughout the events for sharing the experience and the different experiences throughout this 100 year anniversary that we are celebrating if you prefer not to be included in these photographs, please look to Switzerland for this celebration of A. Fogel's centenary milestones. This evening, we commemorate not only the century of innovation and excellence in natural health care solution and herbal remedies, but also celebrate the strong bond between Switzerland and South Africa. More than 100 years ago, Alfred Vogel opened his first store with pure tinctures from fresh plants, enthusiastic about their healing properties, with one mission. I'm back home. The time now is 22.41. The event ended at half past eight, and we just couldn't leave the place. I'm so happy that I went to this event because I got to meet a lot of people. I even forgot that I was vlogging. The conversations were just on fire. Like it was just a lovely space for me to be in. I got I opened on a lot of things because I'm, I know I have 50k followers. Thank God we do have 50k over 50k followers on Instagram. We have 105k followers on TikTok. We have over 3k for um, subscribers over here. But 
I feel like I'm still a baby in this industry. I haven't really learned that much. I still have a lot to learn. And today, today was just amazing. I'm so happy that I, 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 I attended. I honored the invite because I would have naked me tall. Yeah. So they gave us a little something something. I'm so happy that they were actually considering. They gave us this coffee. This is a coffee substitute, actually. It does not have caffeine. And it came right in time when I stopped drinking coffee. But to be honest with you, I would miss coffee. I love the smell of coffee. It's, it's just that it gives me anxiety. So I love that this one is caffeine free. So this is what they gave us. And then some more salt, flu remedy, and more alkaline powder. And the star of the show, a cheese board. <laughs> I love goodie bags. Actually, I love my work. I love my job, guys. I love my job. And I'm super grateful for you guys because I wouldn't be where I am today if it wasn't for you oh and they also gave us chocolates and a pan and a booklet this is the main guy behind the whole brand but he died you know he died so yeah this is what we got i can't wait to do like a cute little unboxing on instagram and also just do reviews using the goodies that i got I really can't wait for that. So right now, I just want to remove this makeup, get into my PJs, and sleep. Because I was in my heels, and we did not really sit down. We were on our feet the whole time. So, yeah, I mean, who wants to sit down when you can network and get to meet people and get to hear what they are on about, where they can plug you, where, like would you even think of sitting down no you won't so yeah anyway my makeup guys it's still on point when i tell you that i need to give classes for makeup tutorials because i eat this thing <laughs> guys i didn't drink alcohol i'm just happy my little heart is full this was my first influencer event it had to you know to shape me there had to be some difference okay so i really really feel full plus also i haven't been out and about i haven't been within people i haven't been you know i've been in this house and i missed myself outside i actually forgot who i am within people so this is just the beginning of me there will be more to come my god is working over time and he is just about to show off so stay tuned anyway let's remove this makeup first the watch the ring i am so tired like actually tired is an understatement tomorrow i have to go to work for crying out loud did you leave more today for the ring but this thing is dark and I'm lazy to reach out for my hand lotion. Ooh, child. Ooh, child. Oh, no. I don't. There we go. Oh, here we are. It's like, so I love the mood. The earrings. Manina Agua better today only, but look, already into gold a itrochil. Where is it? Here in my piercing. Hi.
Just hurry up, get really hot. This is my makeup after all these hours. No touch-ups. I didn't take any brush. I didn't take any beauty blender or any powder. Didn't take my lipstick. I didn't take lip liner. I just went. And this is how we're looking. But now it's time to take it off. I always feel sad when I have to take my makeup off. It's like, I am not enough. You know? I don't want to go to the woman. I don't want to go Guys! I feel like I'm a true definition of practice makes perfect. Everything that I do on my social media, nobody taught me how to do it. I just watched one or two, three, four YouTube videos and I went after it. This is how I learned my makeup. I watched YouTube videos and I would practice every weekend. I would do makeup and I would record it so that it would motivate me to see that I'm actually progressing. So that's how I learned to do makeup. That's how I learned how to cook, how I dress, and in general, how I take care of myself, how to study the word of God. Like everything that I do, I will always go to YouTube if I feel like I don't understand or I want to learn a new skill. Right now, I want to learn how to do my own nails, and I know that I'm gonna kill it. Anyway. My lips were so tight. What a relief. I don't like lashes anymore because, wow. I used to get, my eyes would get teary and I wouldn't enjoy the whole time of me being in makeup. So, this new me. I think right now I am more about minimal to nothing when it comes to everything. Whether it's jewelry, I would rather have just earrings and no necklace or just necklace and small, small earrings or no necklace at all, no ring, no watch, you know. It's either minimal or nothing. Hmm? Oh, this micellar water is my favorite thing right now. I think I should actually do those sit-down videos. Yeah, somebody suggested that I should do sit-down videos when I feel demotivated to film. I used to do these sit-down videos where I share my current favorite things. I would categorize them into current favorite things. Beauty, edition, current favorite things, home decor, edition current favorite things, kitchen wear, current favorite things, fashion wear, uh, edition. Did I almost say fashion wear? Yo. Fashion edition, you know. I used to do those kind of videos. Whoa, what's in my bag, festive season edition. Yo, I miss those videos. I think I should go back. I think I should go back to doing those videos because then you get to know what I like. Ah, oh, man, those videos were so cute. No, I'm going to do those videos. Comment down below if you'd like to see those videos. Comment down below. Let me know. I want to know what you guys like. The vloggy vlogs sometimes, they can be so tiring. Because moving the camera, adjusting the ring light, the adjusting the tripod. You guys, Anna, it's a lot of work, eh? We do it because we love it, but sit down videos are still a thing, man. Hmm? They're still a thing. Oh, Sana. I can't wait to go to bed. I can't wait to go to bed.
you guys i have shared my skincare my night king i have shared my night time skincare routine i'm basically going to do the same thing here exactly the same thing there's nothing special <sighs> i even forgot to put the headband Excellent. I'm just gonna go in with this clean stuff from Mr. Price. Do the things. just doing the same thing one thing for sure is i will never sleep with makeup on never no matter how tired i am i will remove the damn makeup okay i love my skin feeling nourished and well taken care of so i can never skip skincare I'm gonna use this one now because it's actually it doesn't it doesn't burn my eye like it doesn't steam the other one that I just used it's good for like you know when I'm in my mood this one stinks this is how my face is looking i'm gonna do i'm gonna go do the rest of the makeup off camera i mean i'm gonna do go do the rest of the skincare off camera i'm tired thank you for watching this video i love you so much and good night